Oklahoma weather sponsored by Executive Homes. And Annie, you were saying earlier that that tornado was actually one of three to hit Tulsa since 1950. Can you believe that? Only three. Very rare for a tornado to uh, touch down here in Tulsa in the month of August. It can happen, but very rare. What's not rare for August? This heat, we're still holding steady in those 90s, 96 here for Tulsa. We're seeing 96 over in Bartlesville, 101 over in Stillwater, 99 Ponca City, 91 into Grove, 98 at this hour in Coffeeville. For tonight, if you have plans to get out and about, it's going to be a hot one. Make sure you are having those dinner plans, maybe indoors or buy some nice AC because we're going to keep those 90s around. Sunset now closer to about 825 in the evening and those temperatures still holding steady in those 90s. Live look right now using our Wade's RV weather camera network. This is using our tower camera. See a little bit more green out there. Some areas of brown. We could use some rainfall still for our area and we do have some on the way. Showers and storms arriving on Monday. We have some increased opportunities, which I think you're gonna be happy to hear about. Cooler temperatures, big question mark there. We'll talk more about that. Any relief though that we can get, we're gonna be excited for it in the forecast. Heat advisory again for tomorrow. Not quite as widespread in terms of what we're looking at, extending over into Sequoia County, a little bit further south, just off uh, Pittsburgh County, as you could see. But that heat advisory is in effect for tomorrow. Heat index values, meaning what it will feel like upward of about 110 for tomorrow afternoon. That goes into effect from noon until 8 p.m. 99 for your daytime high tomorrow, 98 up in Bartlesville, 96 over in a grove, 100 for Ponca City. But again, with that heat advisory in place, feeling closer to about 105 to 110. You like that rain graphic right there because it's on the way and we need to make sure that that is shining bright because we're all looking forward to that rainfall. 30% chance on your Monday, 40% chance by Tuesday. So Tuesday is looking to be uh, the better of uh, the three days right now. Continuing 30% chance by your Wednesday. And then yes, that heat and humidity will return. But before we get to that, let's talk about how much could potentially be falling in your backyard. I think you're gonna like these rainfall projections that we're looking at right now. Again, Tuesday's looking to be the better of those three days, closer to about an inch here for Tulsa, right over a half of an inch over into Bartlesville. Keep in mind, these are just rainfall projections. This is extending all the way out towards Wednesday night. So I do anticipate these to fluctuate ever so slightly as we get closer and also, as where those thunderstorms will start to fire up because those will be capable of jumping a little bit more rainfall in those locations. In terms of what we're looking at, I told you not really necessarily cooler temperatures, but what we're looking at max heat index values dropping off quite a bit, especially Wednesday into Thursday, feeling like 95, way better than feeling like 105 to 110 that we have been feeling like over the last several days. For tomorrow, 99 degrees, as you can see, hot and mostly sunny. There are those showers and storms arriving Monday, Tuesday. That's going to be your better day on Tuesday and into Wednesday.